Meet our team tokenomics advisor, Talas Langaitis. My name is Talas Langaitis. Uh, my previous experience involves uh, investment banking, corporate finance, venture capital, um, IT business entrepreneurship. I have uh, started or uh, founded and financed several uh, information technology startups. I have actually worked along with them from uh, seed round to the quick business, fast business development to the uh, sale of uh, mature businesses. Um, afterwards, I've been uh, working a lot in uh, public domain and uh, currently now back to investing and developing uh, blockchain technology start. And Noya Network, uh, I'm an advisor. Uh, I focus on advising on business model, token model, token economics and uh, similar domains. What was the deciding factor in joining the Noya Network team? The Noya Network solves a large global problem uh, which influences um, all the internet users worldwide. Um, and that is the lack of content delivery capacity uh, in the world, whereby in effect we could have actually larger quantities uh, of videos of larger quality uh, on our screens than we have today, if not for the existing uh, limitation to the content delivery network capacity. Uh, Noi Network is building an additional layer for content delivery and this is a project of very large uh, see proportions in terms of importance and the economy as well and therefore it's really exciting to be a part of it. As an advisor to NOAA Network, what will be your focus? Uh, so my main focus will be business model, token model design, token economics, uh, figuring out the ways how to incentivize multiple counterparties to the ecosystem uh, of NOAA Content Delivery Network. Could you elaborate a bit on NOAA Network's token economy? Uh, NOAA Network's token economy will provide possibilities to incentivize different stakeholders of the ecosystem. Uh, not only large master nodes, but a small node of any size uh, will be able to participate uh, with its unused bandwidth uh, and uh, earn uh, for this uh, due to low friction cost and due to low cost of the transaction. Uh, if uh, all the payments would need to be settled uh, in fiat currency like Euro or US dollar, uh, there would be a large additional costs in settlements. With no token uh, payments from the clients who need the content delivery to the nodes who provide the content delivery service, the cost will be very low. Um, so that's uh, one important uh, factor that actually enables to attract uh, thousands and thousands of different nodes into the system instead of relying on the central master nodes uh, only. But um, on top of that, uh, the tokens which are easy to transfer uh, create um, additional possibilities uh, for people to transact and additional possibilities for our network team to incentivize the potential new players to attract uh, new players to the uh, ecosystem. Uh, also to regulate um, the work inside the system by uh, inviting the players to stake their tokens to uh, build the trust uh, and to also earn on their nodes uh, more. And also uh, there's a possibility to punish the bad players by taking away their tokens in case they do not play according to the rules. Uh, so NOAA token creates possibilities for uh, NOAA network to regulate how the centralized content delivery network, network will work by uh, motivating the good players, uh, punishing the bad players, uh, having a low friction, low cost uh, value exchange system between the customers and the service providers. How does the current situation in the cryptocurrency market affect NOAA Network? 
talk about cryptocurrencies, trading markets, uh, and uh, their volatility, right? Uh, then, of course, we see the markets are quite emotional comparing to the equities, right? To stocks. Uh, so there are quite significant downturns and, and uh, uh, recoveries, uh, and there is a very usually a bull market is very again uh, strong and very positive bull market uh, uh, with you know, people over investing quickly, and then the bear market is a very sad market where people uh, kind of lose their uh, patience very fast. So I'd say that the, the, it's just the uh, uh, the, the, the cycles of the market are way more frequent, they way faster, uh, much more emotional uh, and definitely much larger swings where the, the whole uh, market capitalization of cryptocurrencies can uh, fall by three times and then rise again by three times uh, within the month. So that's, uh, that, that's unseen in, in, uh, in equities, so let's say in, in equity market, if you have a 10% fall, uh, that's basically a recession, right? Uh, here's the daily business. Uh, in a, it affects the mood of everybody in the market, but I think for uh, business people, and uh, I'm, I'm glad to see that no one in network team is coming from an existing business, um, they look at long term and focus on the business goals and don't uh, sort of uh, mm, spend so much time in uh, seeing, checking out where the market on a daily basis or weekly basis uh, is. It is important from the treasury management point of view or uh, financial management uh, for the business, but the rest of the team uh, actually uh, shall be and will be focused on product development. What do you think of NOAA's network decision to seek funding for public investors in addition to private and institutional ones? So private and institutional investors are fully attended uh, in, in first uh, round, uh, but it is very important for uh, public market to participate, uh, I believe, in the uh, tokenization of, of NOAA network. Um, so that we have uh, as many as possible uh, future nodes uh, participating in the uh, initial uh, point offering in the token generation event. So the target really is to have as many as possible potential future nodes, big and small, um, becoming stakeholders in NOE network early on. How do you see the future of NOE network? Well, if you look uh, at uh, Atomai technologies uh, and see its uh, development in the uh, 90s uh, and early 21st century, I think that's a good uh, that's a good measure of where it can go. The te technology has uh, leaped forward, and uh, uh, well, that was a hardware play. Now it's more of a software play, and it's a token economics play. It's it's a new uh, it's a new game in a sense of that we have now. Uh, a blockchain technology, cryptocurrencies, and token models, token economics innovations um, happening at the same time and producing really interesting uh, opportunities. Uh, so in that regard, it's a new game, but in terms of market adoption and the uh, development of business, I think we have very good um, milestones that we can see from the history of uh, other companies developing content del delivery networks of how far it can go. Akamui Technologies um, delivers 39% of all the content uh, used by internet users uh, daily today. Um, I believe Loi Network in five years can move well uh, along the same uh, path, uh, not uh, eliminating or competing the current players, but building this additional new layer uh, of the market uh, and the total size of the content delivery today will be only one fifth or less of what is going to be in three years only from now. So the pie is, is growing very fast. You don't need to compete uh, and try to outcompete the current players. You only need to take a share of the additional new uh, pie in the market and I believe that Noia Network is posi positioned very well uh, to take a large share of that new 
uh, pie of quantum delivery markets.